What's up guys, my name is Eric Bruce and I'm the host of Vancouver's Worst Ghost Hunters, the show where we get wasted and go ghost hunting, and sometimes when we're not able to organize a ghost hunt, we just get wasted and look at ghost videos on the internet. Uh, this is Chris, he's here as part of a community service project. Uh, you can no longer allow in front of a school within uh, 150 yards. Yeah, but I mean binoculars help though. I feel like I got scratched. Whoa! That fucker was on you when we turned around, upside down. Alright, here we go. We're doing Ghost Screaming in Haunted Hotel, full length, uh, this is just, off of realghostvideos.net. This is just gonna hurt our ears. Yeah. Oh, I'm turning it up full blast, bro. Would you for sure call the cops? Yeah. Send the maintenance guy in here. Hey, no one's checked into that room. No one could be in there. Wait one second, John. Amy, are you there? What would you do in this scenario? John says he hears the screaming. Would you just would you break in and make sure everyone's okay? Damn it, that's a pretty good What are you supposed to do? No one's checked into that room. Be a hero. Kick the door down. Get in there. Don't get paid for that, don't you? Oh no, not at all. See? Yeah, no good call. Amy, John's, uh, John's, gonna enter the room real quick. John's being a fucking hero. John, wait for the cops. John's a goddamn American. John, you fucking idiot. Is that door shuts? Oh, there's something walking past there. Did you see that? Or is it? John. Lights flick around me. John, are you there? <laughs> Why did you call them before? Uh, he says no one's in there, uh, but that all of the furniture has been turned upside down and the, and the, hold on. He says the carpet's been ripped up and the shower is on, but nobody's in there. Man, that's, that's scary. I'm, uh, officially freaked out now. I'll say if that's real, that's pretty intense. It sounds like John got super wasted, <laughs> <laughs> fucking ripped up one of the hotel rooms, <laughs> and then was like, oh, I better cover my ass. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, everything's turned upside down. Yeah. The carpets are up. Someone <laughs> shit in the sink. Picks up the tape recorder of <laughs> yeah. the fucking that he left in there of the girl screaming. Uh. <laughs> yeah. There's empty alcohol bottles in here. I don't know why. Oh, my someone put a bunch of pictures of me with a plunger in my ass. Oh, that's weird. Oh, there's a dead hooker on the ground. How'd she get here? <laughs> Name's Darlene. Not that I would know. <laughs> All right, John, get out of there. Call the cops. John, you're a hero. You're a real hero. Get out of there, bud. There's a reason why John didn't call the cops in the first place. He's like, well, yeah, it's weird, but nothing's wrong. Oh, I don't need to call the cops. What? My dead ex-wife is in here. <laughs> what? Oh, no. Oh, man. What? Oh, Will leaving everything to me, <laughs> right next to her. <laughs> we always did have similar handwriting. Um, people are wondering what's happening with the channel, because um, we're posting a lot of these haunted reviews. Um, the idea is is that it's really hard to organize ghost hunts, so we're going to have weekly haunted reviews for all of 2017. Wow. If you have any haunted locations... Uh. Send them to me. Uh, you can find us on Facebook at Vancouver's Worst Ghost Hunters. Look it up. And if you have a location we can film at, we will come out. We will do our thing. It'll be amazing. Cheers. Yeah, cheers. Oh, 